Hello everyone, this is Crystal with more photos again. I just wanted to make a video about how easy it is to create website pages in the new Gen 2 Online Manager. Okay, what you're going to do is you're going to log into your Online Manager. You're going to select Website Editor here. Then website pages okay and it's going to bring you right to this page I already had it up before I started the video so that's why you didn't really see much of a change but this page right here shows all of the different pages uh, that you have added okay so I have a home and order online portfolio about okay and what I'm going to do is just run you through how to create a page and some of the new features with creating pages now so much easier. You guys are going to love this, especially if you're an existing More Photos client. This is some really cool stuff. So, chose Add New. And right here, um, you're going to put in your page name. So, <clears throat> let's create just a test page for now. Okay. Down here, if you want this to show up in your menu live in the navigation, then you're going to choose Add to current layout menu and the sort order is just like our old system if you want one to show up before the other one you can put in an order here okay so I'm just I'm just gonna have it be the third page um, the template this is one of the coolest parts okay that you can choose different templates for each page instead of having to learn HTML code and put in tables or you know fuss around with the way things are laying out we have pre-made this for you. So right here you can choose one column layout, two column layout, which would be the one column layout has one large image with the content below it. Two column layout has two columns with images up top. Three has three, obviously. And um, this one's really cool. The two section layout one we are going to be coming out with a lot more layouts, but this is just kind of our standard at the moment for the beta version of Gen 2. Uh, if you have panoramic images that you'd like to display, especially on one of your website pages, two section layout one is awesome for that. Right here, this displays a beautiful panoramic image with content below it along with two smaller images with content below. So for this test page I'm just going to make it very simple and choose a one column layout so you guys can get the idea of how this works. Okay, We're going to go over to the content tab now. Now right here this is how you create the page. You have your editing tools up top, you know, your bold, italic, you know, how you want your paragraph to be aligned, etc. Okay, now right here you have your page title. Um, again, I'm just going to put this as test. Okay. Then you have a section title. So <clears throat> I'm just going to leave it as section title. Okay. For the test page. Right here, you can use our awesome new drag and drop feature and put in that nice large image that you want to show up on that page. I'm just going to go ahead and grab. An image that I have up right now. It's a pretty beach picture and it is going to upload it right there. Okay, so see right here you've got the test, uh, which is going to be your title. You've got the section title. So if you want kind of that subheading is what it can be referred to in, in like WordPress systems and some other um, template style websites. Okay, you've got your image. It's going to come up full size. So if you want a smaller image, make sure you go ahead and resize that down a little bit. Um, our, our website templates are mobile responsive, so if someone's viewing on, say, you know, a phone or a tablet, it will resize that image down. But if you want people to see your content right away too, you know, you want to you want to think about the size of that that large image like that. So you have your heading. You can just put in your your heading right there and your content. All right. So this is my content for my test page. It's that simple. If you want to add a paragraph, you can go ahead and add a paragraph in there. And you can 
add in more content. All you do is you go ahead and save that page and it's going to show up right here. Okay, so it's that simple to create a page. It's pretty cool stuff and if you go on over to your site, or I guess I just choose log off right here, you will see your test page right there. You've got your, your the title of the page, you've got your section title test. It's going to resize your image to fit good into the, the content area. You've got your heading test, again, content, and then that was that next paragraph I added. So if you want to have multiple paragraphs, you can do that. So it's that simple just to create a website page. I'll be creating some more videos with some of the other features we have coming out. And if you're not a More Photos client, definitely check our system out. We have a full uh, system so that you can have your, your online presence, your storefront, shopping cart, um, uploading software, real-time processing. If you're a photographer, we've got green screen backgrounds. We have all different kinds of features. You can go to morephotos.com, check out our features page if you'd like. You can see each one. Um, <clears throat> written out and what it does. You can see all 200 features uh, with more still being added. So you guys have a great day and keep an eye out for more videos on the new features with Gen 2.